All right, so what's up guys? Today I'm actually on my way to my friend's house. He's going to help me install something today on the Mustang. And by the title of the video, y'all, you guys probably know what I'm getting installed. But if you don't, I'll let you guys see what it is when I get there. They're not loud, but they will get a whole lot louder when I take off the cats. All right, so I'm at my boy Kayshawn's house. I don't know if Kayshawn wants to be on the camera, so I'm gonna ask him. But before we get to that, I just wanna show you guys what I'm getting installed on the Mustang today. This is a plug and play kit for the Mustang. So as you can see, I have the four inch screen right here. And this plug and play kit, it pretty much takes out the four inch screen and replaces it with a double den radio. So if I got this, that means I have a double den radio in the works. That brings us to this right here. Now I'm not sponsored by anybody. Um, I got this off eBay, another eBay uh, cop, you know, but I got this on eBay because it has everything that I pretty much want in a double den radio. As you can see, this is Apple CarPlay. It also has Android Auto uh, for those who uh, don't have an iPhone and still want to use this radio. Um, and it has like has backup camera aux, so I can still probably use my my uh, factory backup camera. So that's good. And it just has everything else that I could need and it has no CD input, which is fine because the CD input is right there and I'm pretty sure it still uses it. Um, it's, it's basically just a swap, so it'll still be able to use it. So I'm gonna tell him I'm outside and then I'll let him know if he, if he wants to be in the video or not. So I might have to just uh, skip around to after when everything's installed and then I'll go from there, so. One second, guys. But before I tell them I'm outside, I might as well do a quick little unboxing for you guys. Try to do this with one hand, so forgive me if I seem like I'm challenged. But I did get a head start with the tape earlier, so that helps. All right. So far, so good. This is probably, oh, it's got tape right here too. Why? Ugh. Hold up, guys. All right, so I got the tape off both sides. Now I get to open the top. Oh my gosh, this tape is so sticky. All right, come here. All right, so uh, we got wires, of course, and we got instructions. Nice. It's really nicely packaged, I will say. Hold on. All right. Now, I might just let it, I'm gonna let it fall into this chair because it's like, it's not that, it's still got foam on it, so. All right, nice and easy. It's off. Ooh. 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 That looks pretty nice, I'm not gonna lie. And what I like about this one, stay there for me what i like about this one is it doesn't have the usb port on the side because it kind of looks tacky in a way to me when it has the usb on the side you got the usb hanging right there usb is in the back so you can make it more sleek looking and all that good stuff so um it looks really good um hopefully it performs very good i'm gonna take this off whenever it's all installed just so i can um <laughs> Just so I can make it feel a little bit more special. So, uh, it says there's a warranty on it, so that's cool too. So, yeah, just your basic little double den radio. And obviously, I got this over here. Now, I bought this like two years ago, so it's already open, um, so you don't get the traditional um, unboxing. But 
this is the bezel right here. It's pretty much all we need right here. So just as a, as a, a pretty much a before and after. So it's gonna look like that, but it's gonna have that radio right there in the middle. So it's gonna look really clean. Uh, hopefully everything works and everything don't run into no issues. So, so like I said, uh, he should be here at any moment. I told him that I'm outside. So if we do record and he wants to show his face or he wants to be in a video, I'll let you guys see. If not, I'll just cut to the end and I'll give you guys a review on it based off first installation. So we'll see what happens. Mama, there goes that man. Mama, there goes that man. <laughs> I'm a YouTuber now. <laughs> he said, oh, dang. <laughs> Yeah, bro. You told me all that, man. I would have, would have came a little fresh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you got the jacket, you got the the cowboy boots. Oh. <laughs> Heck yeah, bro. You gonna help me out today? Yeah, I'm gonna get you right, man. All right. So I'm at like 70 something subscribers right now. Right. Um, and I'm thinking when I hit 100 subscribers, uh, you know that like abandoned like warehouse where we went to that one time uh -huh. a while back, it was like a couple months back, like abandoned like warehouse sort of. Yeah. Yeah, I was thinking we could go in there. Have y'all been inside there yet? Which one? Oh. Cause we've been in one of them and it was, it was a school. I think it was like a high school, old high school. Uh, was I'm not talking about the high school. I'm talking about the, um, it was a while back. It was me, you, Jesse, uh, Dom, uh, the guy with the uh, the 392 Charger, the uh, Challenger, and we all we all were um, we were all riding that one day when Jesse had the the Z, uh -huh. the gray Z, and we all stopped at that one spot. And he that dude did a a, a donut there. Remember? Oh, you want to go in there? Yeah, I want to go in there. <laughs> I don't know if that I don't know if it's like abandoned or not. Bruh, it's pretty a bad. I go there all the time where I record my videos. You were in? Not inside, but that's I, what you want to do though. Yeah, I want to go inside when I hit 100 subscribers. That's what I want to do. Mm, I want I want me, you, and Jesse, and whoever Keem can come. I don't care. I mean, because it's like right there. It's like right. I don't see why not. I don't see why it would be a problem. It would be a problem. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it's abandoned too, so. I hope so. Just an idea. Okay, yeah. So that's what I got. This came like this? The carpet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It came like that from Ford. Some people, some people have to like do it themselves, but this one came with it. I think it started with 2017. It started with the carbon fiber. I was thinking about getting me a BMW. Yeah, that's what I was really thinking about. A BMW. Uh... Why you need a BMW when you got the, the show right here? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the V6, y'all. Hey, don't, don't, don't knock the V6, though. Don't knock the V6, though. Just, just, just that thing right here. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey, don't talk about my car. My car moved. Oh, no, 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 I was talking about my car. My car move a little bit. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know the push start button was all the way down there. Yeah, it's like, it's right down there. I definitely want to put a turbo in this, in this bad boy. If I put a twin turbo in this on E85, look at that, 500 wheel. Dang. Yeah. You don't want to go that fast. <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't. I don't even think I'd probably go that fast. I'd probably just get it just to say I got it, you know. Just so people would like not be, mess with you. Exactly, right? Won't mess with me, so they'll be like, "Oh, he's got 500 horsepower." I don't want to mess with him. I don't want to lose to a V6. <laughs> people don't like it when you lose to a V6, bro. See them stingers are, are moving too. Oh, the key stinger! Oh my gosh. Those things are bad, bro. Either I'm gonna get that or, or the 50 Z again. Mm. All right, man. I'm trying to get it to where I like. Can you try to pull up on that side? There you go. 
Yeah. Came out? Yeah. That's how I did. There we go. Teamwork makes the dream work. Oh, yeah, I gotta disconnect the uh, cigarette. Oh, crap. <laughs> this doesn't have a CD player on it, so I can't use the CD. Oh, well. You don't need no CDs. <laughs> I mean, I, I got a CD. I got I got Bryson Tiller CD that I burned. <laughs> oh well, it's 2020. One, 2021. No CDs. So got the radio out, CD player, and the sink. So as you can see, we got it in there. I will say this kit is not perfect, but overall, it looks pretty good. I can't complain. Apple Play works, all that good stuff. We should have tried that. <laughs> we should have tried. I mean, it should work because it didn't unplug. Um, the cord's down there. Oh, uh, my phone's right here. Yeah, it works. All right, bet, bet. So yeah. Apple CarPlay works, so I got Google Maps, all that good shit. Why you got eyelashes on top of your camera, bro? What are you talking about? My eyebrows on top of your camera. Bro, this is, see, you're a rookie. rookie. <laughs> hey, you see, we got a rookie. These are these are wind stoppers, AKA dead cats. It's, it blocks the wind from the I was, camera. I was like, this man's getting all technical. <laughs> <laughs> camera. I wanna block the wind, man. You don't wanna, you wanna catch that wind noise in your, the video. Oh, so the mics are right there. Yeah, the mics are on the top of the camera. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So, like I said, finished product. It's a headache, but it was well worth it. My boy over there about to pull out. Wait a minute. Hold, wait, first of all, you're not gonna speed past that like you didn't just say what you just said. Appreciate you, my guy. No problem, man. You, know, <laughs> you had to put me out there, man. What you, what you want to plug? You want to plug your IG? Man. What IG? Um, life underscore two real underscore K. That's what it is. All right. I'll put that in the description and on the screen for y'all. Anyway, another mod, another day. Something, something new every time, you know. Now I'm about to... Are we going... You going to Sonic? I guess I'll go to Sonic too. Alright, well, I'll catch y'all in the next video. Like, share, subscribe. V6 still exists.